I am Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrocca in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link on this Thursday late afternoon around 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Take a look at uh, a cool and uh, raw day today with uh, temperatures that topped out in the uh, middle to upper 40s. We officially made it to uh, 48 degrees here in Providence. Of course, had the rain this morning and the mist and drizzle this afternoon. Uh, steady rain has moved out, but we are left with some mist and drizzle, and that should continue uh, into the early evening hours. Take a look at, uh, well, things that we're keeping an eye on, which includes uh, a damp evening, but as far as downpours or any heavy rain, uh, that is gone, but areas of mist will continue. And with the humidity on the rise this evening and overnight, we'll get some areas of fog forming as well. Friday uh, is a pretty interesting weather day for a couple of reasons. Well, for one, it's a very windy day, and it's unseasonably warm. We're forecasting temperatures to be well into the 60s, but keep in mind, you really have to be away from the coast and away from the ocean. We think near the ocean, it will be cooler in the 50s. Uh, it's not a washout. There'll be many hours where it's not showering. But we do have the chance for a few isolated thunderstorms. Uh, the first chance very early in the morning, um, say around 5, 6 a.m., and then another chance coming up during the early evening hours. And, and the concern with an approaching cold front around you know, 7, 8 o'clock Friday evening. You know, some thunderstorms could be locally strong, maybe some damaging wind. It's a low risk, but the chance is there. That's something we're going to keep an eye on. In the meantime, uh, the weekend still looks good. It's dry, bright, and cooler uh, Saturday, and it's Sunday. Take a look at the satellite and radar composite, and a steadier rain has moved away, but we are mainly cloudy. Now, when we widen out the view, uh, you can clearly see our next uh, weather system out across uh, the Midwest. Now, it looks like the thrust of this precipitation is going to pass to our north, but we will get clipped with a few isolated showers or an isolated uh, thunderstorm. So that's what it looks like right now as it tracks off to the north and east. Uh, we can take this into the future. And let me let's stop this at about uh, 6 a.m. And you see a batch of showers, maybe an isolated thunderstorm early. That'll move out. We'll get into a bit of a lull out here where it doesn't, there's not much going on the rest of Friday. And then this line of showers and thunderstorms. Watch. We'll have to keep an eye on that towards Friday evening. Now, this is Friday evening at, uh, let's see, 7 o'clock. And right in here. And some of these thunderstorms could be strong as they pass through here between roughly 7 and 9 p.m. on Friday. In fact... Uh, the severe thunderstorm outlook, there's actually a marginal risk, uh, somewhat of a low risk, but a chance nonetheless in this area in darker green just to our west out towards the Connecticut River Valley, the risk of some severe thunderstorms. This lighter green, look at the color code up here, that's general non-severe thunder as possible. But, you know, some of these storms just to our west may get a little robust. And if they hold together, we'll have to keep an eye on the situation, and that would be for early on Friday evening. It's getting real close here. We'll walk you through it hour by hour. Starting off this evening with uh, low clouds, fog, a little bit of mist and drizzle. And notice the temperature is actually rising. Now, this is interesting. Early on, uh, on Sunday morning, looking at an isolated strong thunderstorm around 6 a.m., then notice that we get into a lull. It's windy and warm. And notice where the warmest weather is, 60s inland, 50s at the coast. This is 2 o'clock. And then by 6 o'clock in the evening, inland, we're in the 60s. Coastline, we're in the um, 50s. And then watch this narrow ribbon of yellow and red coming through around 8 o'clock in the evening. That's when some of these thunderstorms could be strong. Boom, gone, clearing out later Friday night. So this evening, kind of cool and misty, low clouds and areas of fog, temps in the 40s. And here we are on your Friday morning with an early uh, morning thunderstorm, then cloudy, windy, and warmer. 58 by 11 a.m., and then Friday afternoon, windy and warm towards around 7, 8 o'clock. We'll watch for an isolated, strong thunderstorm. And again, uh, those 60s won't be realized unless you're away from the coastline. Gusty southwest breeze, 15 to 25, may see gusts over uh, 30 miles per hour. So, you know, somewhat of an active uh, weather day coming up on Friday, and then the weekend looks pretty good. That's your latest Weather Now update. Thanks for logging in. We'll talk to you soon.